Alright, so we are with our homegirl Faith here at the wonderful Five Lows Farm. Could you please just tell us real briefly, since this place is special to you, um, a little bit about this place um, and why we were here today? Yeah, um, so Five Loves Farm is, is like run by my dad. Um, it's really cool because like I get to come here a lot. Uh, I'm really involved in like this place. Um, I come here like almost every week at least once. Um, it's it's like definitely involved in our church, so that's also really important. It's involved in our community. Like all the people in this neighborhood know who we are and like like to come and like say hi every once in a while. Uh, yeah, so pretty much. That's cool. So you're a member of Hype, um, Healthy Youth, Positive Energy. So what is it about this program that made you decide to join? Um, you could do so many other things with your time. So why did you decide to join this program? So my dad was the first one that told me about this because um, the farm youth were doing it. And um, so he wanted me to do it too. And so I joined and I thought it was fascinating the things that they were doing. And so I kept with it and I was like, oh, I actually really want to do this and like pursue this. And so I kept going and then I got involved a little bit in like some of the things that Sarah and the other leaders were um, like doing with us. And it turned out to be a lot of fun. I was in a couple of, um, uh, what are they called? Uh, workshops and yeah, things like that. Cool, cool. So is there anything um, that you would say to a young person who may be deciding whether or not to join Hype to kind of encourage them to join? Yeah. Well, you also get a lot of opportunities to do a bunch of things. Um, it's more than just like doing like things on food and like doing things on like certain subjects. Like you get to kind of like pursue what you want to. So, yeah. That's awesome. Okay. So, I guess maybe two, three more questions. So, is there anything that um, you would change or add to make Hype um, a better program or to get Hype um, available to more youth in the city? Um, I think if, like, we put more um, ads out for, like, Hype and if people talked about it more. Okay. Cool. Um, and so, the Buffalo Public Schools um are coming up with like a food truck is there anything that you would like to know about this pub buffalo public schools food truck um or are you even excited about this food truck uh yeah i think it's really interesting that they're doing that and it's really cool that they're doing that um i think i would like to know like when the the food truck is going to be like near me so that maybe i could get um like food from the food truck or like get to know a little bit more about like their program with that. Cool. Um, and so we have um, the Healthy Corner Store Initiative. Um, and so we're just wondering, do you feel like the, the stores in your neighborhood um, sell the food that you and your family like to eat? And if yes, what foods are they? And if no, what do you wish that they had? So I think something that I've realized is there's a corner store right next to where I live. and. Like the kids in our neighborhood will be like, oh, let's go to the corner store. And they come back with like chips and soda and things like that. And like, I think if they had like healthier options, kids would go there and be like, I'm hungry. I want this food. And then they go and they see all these healthy options that actually taste really good. And then they get those things instead of getting the chips and the soda. So I think it would be really cool if they had like healthier snacks or and like things like that at the corner store. Awesome, thank you so much. And so as a young leader in our community, is there anything that you want to say to maybe inspire or motivate other young people to become more involved in their community, whether it's with health or wellness or whatever they're interested in? Um, yeah. So I think it's really fun like getting involved with your community. You get to know the people in your community, you get to know like the organizations in the community, and you get to like learn a lot more than you, like you think you know a lot about your community and then you get more involved and you learn so much more. And it's like, and you're like kind of amazed by what's in your community that you didn't even know about. 
And so, yeah. Cool. Thank you very much. Um, I appreciate that. Thank you for your time. Thank you for having us too.